Hello. Do you know who you are looking at? You are looking at me. And I am the 166th member of the Abiko Artists Association, or Artists of the Abiko Parish. No, uh, I don't know what the actual translation is, but it's a bunch of basically retirees who <laughs> who pay their 20 bucks, 2,000 yen a year for the right to exhibit themselves or their art in the local shopping mall. We have two shopping malls. This one is the slightly posher shopping mall called Espa. And this picture behind me is my fourth oil painting entitled, <laughs> or titled it should be, but people always say entitled, different story. Uh, called Sushi and um, it's a picture, it's a um, oil painting that I did, uh, well it's the fourth one and I'm trying to do a series of sort of aspects of Japanese life um, and teach myself how to do oil paintings at the same time. I took a couple of pictures of, of the missus in uh, last time we went to a sushi place, the uh, Kaiten Sushi, the conveyor belt sushi place. Um, which, uh, you know, doesn't say, doesn't say, you don't say much more than, well, kaiten sushi, uh, sushi place, you don't get much more Japanese than that. Perhaps karaoke, which is one of the other pictures I did before, but anyway. So, um, yeah, so uh, I painted this, and um, in my uh, twice monthly art class, the, um, the chap there was eager for us to exhibit our wares. Um, so uh, so he signed me up. So in April, I think April 13th, from the April 13th, I think, or that weekend of April, uh, for about a month, uh, Sushi will be hanging with uh, with the uh, hoi, not with the hoi polloi, with the, uh, with the top brass of the Abiko Art Establishment. I will be at the Salon. <laughs> no, 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 I mean, um, I've been to one, of, I had a look at one of their shows before, and um, yeah, it's full of um, amateurs' artworks. A couple of pros and a couple of like, art teachers with their classes. So I shouldn't be blasted out of the waters. Um, uh, there'll be lots of uh, watercolours and still lifes and flowers and stuff like that. Maybe a few portraits, but I, I don't know if there's going to be any live-action shots from the Sushi Emporium. There will be from me. Um... Yeah, anyway, I'm having fun with this, and uh, I just put a few finishing touches on it today. I, I had finished it before, but I showed it to my art teacher, and he, he suggested that the the the, um, the sofa here needed to be more green, greener, and um, uh, and a more of a contrast. Actually, I had this was green, and this was green, and he said, you need to have more of a contrast. You have to draw a line across there, and uh, so I thought I'd make it, make it brown, because... He also said that these bars here, they were originally yellow and they looked too similar to everything else, so I made it browner. Basically, bringing out more contrast um, and adding more paint. I think that's what beginners, the mistake that beginners make is the, we're too um, timid. Um, so I, I added a bit more colour and um, uh, yeah, just tarted it up a bit for public uh, showing. And I bought myself some frames. Uh, well, actually, one frame, and it does look really nifty in the frame, but it's still the paint's still wet. So from the one from my touching up, so I didn't want to put it in. <clears throat> if you want to see it in a frame, you better come to a Vico. <laughs> yeah. Uh, wow, the exciting life of an artist. Um, I can see why they starve. <laughs> still, I'm quite happy with it, and I'm um, quite excited, quite fun, and. Um, We'll see. Uh, we'll see. See what other people do. That'd be quite interesting. Um, yeah, uh, I want to improve a lot, and one day it'd be nice to be able to sell some art. I can dream. Anyway, have a good one. So from my studio, goodbye.